30 kilometers off the Danish west coast is Horns Reef 2, the world's largest offshore wind farm to date. On the 5th of May 2008, the Danish Minister for Climate and Energy, Connie Hugo, and Executive Vice President, Niels Bjell Hansen, as well as Project Manager, Henrik Lehmann, threw the towing line to the barge containing the first foundations for Horns Reef 2. And with this symbolic gesture, the building of the magnificent construction masterpiece was officially opened. Never have so many and so large offshore wind turbines been built so far from the shore. The turbines are now firmly planted on the seabed, proving Denmark's clear wish to produce more wind power. A milestone on the way towards the goal that 30% of Danish energy needs is to be covered by renewable energy by 2020. At the same time, Horns Reef 2 is a vital step towards fulfilling Dong Energy's 2020 objective of tripling the company's renewable production capacity. Horns Reef 2 will go into operation less than 20 months after the first foundation was placed. This makes the offshore wind farm proof of how Danish engineering and good partners are able to realize visionary plans in a short time and under difficult working conditions. More than 600 people and 25 vessels have been involved in the construction of Horns Reef 2. Precision work and constant focus on safety are vital aspects when working with such big structures. To make a more than 100 meters long wind turbine stand firmly on the seabed, it is important that the foundations are placed with great accuracy. The steel piles that are hammered into the seabed are between 30 and 40 meters, depending on their location on the reef. Large structures and difficult working conditions require comprehensive safety measures. Therefore, all personnel working at Horns Reef 2 have been through a safety course before gaining access to the site. The power from each wind turbine is sent through a cable to the offshore wind farm substation. About 70 kilometers of cable has been laid at Horns Reef 2. The cables also contain fibernet, which can transmit communication and control signals to and from each turbine. From the substation, the produced power is led to shore through a 42 kilometers long sea cable. In May 2009, the first turbine was connected to shore and for the first time we were able to send power through the cable. Through climate partnerships with Dong Energy, a number of Danish companies and local governments have agreed to cover their electricity needs with power from Horns Reef 2. Novo Science and Novo Nordisk have reserved more than half of the production. When completed, Horns Reef 2 is the world's largest offshore wind farm. Truly a fantastic project. And more are in the pipeline. Walnut and Gunfleet Sands are already in progress. And in the beginning of 2011, Dong Energy and our partners start building the offshore wind farm London Array in the North Sea at the mouth of the Thames. When completed, London Array will become the largest offshore wind farm in the world. The first phase of London Array will have an amazing production capacity of 630 megawatts. The Horns Reef 2 turbines are produced by Siemens Wind Power. And we will also be using offshore wind turbines from Siemens Wind Power for London Array. Through a pioneering agreement with Dong Energy, Siemens Wind Power is to deliver up to 500 wind turbines for future Dong Energy offshore wind farms. With Horns Reef 2, Denmark and Dong Energy have taken yet another step towards more renewable energy.
We would like to thank all our partners and employees who have helped realizing Horns Reef 2. Dong Energy. Moving energy forward.